iOS 16.5 is out now, and it's not a big update by any means, but there are a few things worth mentioning. Starting off with Apple News, Apple has added a dedicated sports tab, providing sports fans with quick access to stories, scores, standings, and other information that you might want to know. Now, Apple News users can select their favorite teams and leagues to get personalized news. Tapping on sports score and schedule cards in Apple News now goes directly to game pages populated with additional information about specific games. To go along with the new 2023 Pride Apple Watch Band and Watch Face, Apple has designed a Pride Celebration lock screen that is available in the iOS 16.5 update. Now, in terms of bug fixes, this update does fix a few issues with Spotlight becoming unresponsive at times. It also addresses the CarPlay issue where podcast app may not load certain content. And lastly, this update fixes an issue where screen time settings may reset or not really Really sync at all across all devices. There's also a new function that allows Siri to start and stop a screen recording using voice commands. So in theory, you would just say, hey, you know, and then start a screen recording. And then also you can ask Siri to stop the screen recording as well. This was introduced in beta one, but for some reason, Apple has quickly removed it, but hopefully it will make its way in before iOS 17. And so, yeah, that was iOS 16.5. It's available now. This should be one of the last updates. There might be a 16 point six before we get iOS 17 next month. But of course, I would love to hear from you in the comments down below. What do you think of this update and what are you hoping to see in iOS 17 coming at WWDC in early June? This has been Dan with Mac Rumors. Thanks so much for watching and I hope to see you around in the next video.